sized HP Design Jet T120 auto refill ink jump the interlock so we can leave the door open. Then I'm going to pull the and power. And then we're going to pull the power. If it's going. And you can see we want it to stop right in the center there so we can move it by hand. Don't do this while it's under power. All right. Okay, now I'm going to put the system in. Okay, now we're going to get ready to install the system. Now this has been completely revised. It's got to go over the top. Mm -hmm. Now it comes all assembled. All the mounting brackets are already assembled on it. You don't have to do that. But pay close attention to where we stick these brackets. And just take your time. Just take your time. Get this all the way out of the way first. Okay, now we want to take the printhead assembly out of the way. And we're feeding it right on under. And now it's going to come out. And we're going to slide the printhead all the way back. Okay, now we're going to put the printhead back. Take your time here. And if you want to come over here. Okay, now we're going to come over here. I'm going to show you put them in. Also, we're using our new COC smart chips that reset the ink levels back to full. It cuts down on a lot of the error codes. And these new cartridges will also prime the printhead. So you're actually going to get actual ink levels now. And it's, it'll, you'll just reset it, and the ink level will go back to full. Okay, now Slowly. push at the bottom. Load from the bottom. Don't push on the top. Okay. Now, here's where it's going to get a little tricky, because we're going to show you how to put the hose bracket in. Get some more slack over here. Now, we're going to come out the top. There you go. This is the now, there's the bracket. Let me fix the camera here. Okay, there's the bracket. You're going to peel and stick it. Get that little plastic up there. So, take your time here. Now we want to put it right here in this area, right here. Underneath, yeah. Right underneath there's a flat spot. Yep. Just kind of line it up. Line it up. Just like right under here. Touch it. And then go ahead with your hands. And then you push it. Press there. it together. Now this comes all pre-installed. Now we have these already on the chain hose. Yeah. With your hands, just go ahead and... Now we got to go over here. Slide it. You're going to slide it. Because now the hose is going to come underneath this bracket, come on out, and then go down Just check to the your, side of the printer. You check your hose travel when it's not. Now we're going to check your hose travel to make sure that you have it right. Just like go ahead. Now, what this chain hose bracket does, it stops the hose from hitting, dragging, and stops any type of binding because this is a long wide format printer and that hose could just fall down. So now we've added this feature right here. Now come on over here, but you want to make sure here. it doesn't pinch. No pinch. It'll come right out the side. There's an opening actually. And right you'll here. be able to pull the interlock and then close the top. That's that little jumper we put in. There. Oh, right there. And the hose would come out. Side. And then you can put this pretty much anywhere you want. But right. So just hook in there like there. that, pretty much. And then just make sure you open up all of the air plugs yeah, here. Yeah, make sure you open up the air plugs after you balance the ink tank, because you've got to balance it when you first get it. We show you that in the instructions, but basically you're going to rock it. That's going to take all the ink that got into the isobaric chamber during shipping. Okay, now. Now you'll be able to plug it back in. Okay, now we're going to open that lid up back again, and we're going to put that jumper in. Just so you can see our hose so travel. So you can watch your hose travel. We're going to plug it in. Now we've got one there and one up front. These little pieces of paper here. 
how to print all start up. How it starts to move. You can see the way the hose moves back and forth with that chain. Nice and easy, it glides smooth. Okay, now it's going back and forth. That's how simple it was to install it. You've got one bracket here, hose comes up here. One on the outside. And one on the outside. Now that's that new hose chain. The hose actually travels right within the chain. Okay, now here's the uh, ink level. Now these chips, these new COC chips, the ink level is going to go down. You press on the cartridge, release it momentarily, push it in, then the ink level is going to go back.